I'm gonna make a paint and drip flower pot. Now, I've never tried this before, but I've always wanted to. I saw it on Pinterest, thought it was a great idea to show you guys on my channel, and it's a kind of a nice day outside. It's rainy, but we have our giant umbrella, and that's what that orange glow is on me. Our giant umbrella that's keeping me out of the rain. So I thought this would be a good thing to do outside, though. All right, guys. First, what you need is paint. It is a paint drip flower pot, so you will need lots and lots of paint. Probably not this much, but these are just a bunch of different colors that I chose. These are just acrylic craft paint. You can get them from the dollar store or a lot of different craft stores carry them. And I'm sure, you, I'm sure you guys have seen them before. But those are just ones that we had laying around. You can see that obviously we got some on clearance and then other ones we just had laying around. Then you'll need a cookie sheet that you need to align with aluminum foil. And I only needed one sheet of aluminum foil, but if you if yours is bigger than this, because you don't have a smaller one, just do two aluminum foil uh, sheets overlapping each other. Then we have the good old flower pot, and it is just a regular clay flower pot, and you guys should be able to do it with like a plastic flower pot. I'm sure it'll work just fine, but I had a clay one that I wanted to use because I love the clay ones. What you'll also need to do is right here at the top, I have tape. If you buy a brand new one, then there should be a sticker here. Leave the sticker on until you're done painting it and it's done drying. Now, I did tape because this is an old one that I honestly just found laying around the yard, and so I needed tape for it. So, let's get started. The first color I'm going to be doing is this interesting purple I have. Now, what we'll need to do is just simply drip the paint here on the, the rim of the bottom and it'll drip and go down your flower pot. And it looks really, really cool. So. And it'll just drip like that. Obviously put more paint on, but let's continue painting. All right, I finished putting the paint on. It looks super cool. I love the col colors I chose. And now we just have to wait for it to dry. And it's the idea where I got this from, it says about a day, but pretty much just let it sit there until you see that the paint is dry. Then when it's dry, your flower pot will be all ready. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love the flower pot. This is such a cool thing to try. Definitely try it out. Tell me how your guys' has turned out because I think this is so cool. Tell me the color combos you guys use. And I will definitely be decorating flower pots in the future. This has been a lot of fun. Hope you caught that creative bug.